listening. Hello, and welcome to Portrait of an Interview. I am your host, famous painter, Andy Bisha. And with me today is Corey Stewart. Corey, how are you today? I'm well. How are you, Andy? Oh, I'm so good. Thank you for having me on. I'm so happy that you agreed to come on without a court summons. Oh, well, you're my boss, so I kind of have to. We're going to be painting a wonderful portrait of Corey. Now, before I start any painting, Corey, you know what I like to do? What's that? I like to thank the canvas. Thank you, canvas. Thank you for giving... Why aren't you bowing your head? Oh, sorry. Please, please. Thank you for giving us this immense responsibility of creating beautiful art with you, Portrait. This unmistakable muse that will give his essence to this canvas and forever his soul will be imbued into it. Thank you, we thank you for that. All right, now here's something I like to do. It's called fumble brush. You just, you just kind of rub the brushes in your hand until you find a brush that you're ready to use. I think it's gonna be this one. All right. We're, we're gonna, we're gonna tease, we're gonna tease it. No, not yet. <laughs> so let's get started, Corey. Okay. Okay, Corey. What tickles you? Uh, um, what tickles Corey? Uh, I'm I'm sorry. I, you know, what tickles you? Uh, I I I guess if what you're trying to ask me is uh, why weren't these paints open in advance? Huh? Go on. Ah. Uh, well, uh, I, I guess what you're trying to ask me is, you know, what, what interests me or what, you know. No, no, what, what tickles you? Uh, fingers, mm. uh, sometimes tickle. Now, do, you, do, you have a, do you have a long history with, with fingers? Uh, I mean, when I was a kid, I guess I was tickled by my sisters uh, growing up. Your sisters? Yeah, uh, you know, tickle fights. And is that, was that what they told you to call it, Corey? Uh, not Tick really. Tickle fights? Uh, it was it was more so them just pinning me down and tickling me until I... This may sound a little odd, Corey, but did they... Did they touch you anywhere else? No, no, no. I mean, this is a safe space. No, no, this is about no, art. It was, we were kids. We just played. That was how kids played. How many cheeseburgers have you eaten in your life? Uh, I, I guess like... A thousand? Two thousand? I, I lost count. I, I don't really count my cheeseburger intake. Now, if you've eaten over a thousand cheeseburgers, how come you haven't basically turned into one? I don't think that's how that works. Oh, wait, Corey. Oh, precious Corey. You are what you eat, my friend. I, I guess. <laughs> Guessing is for scientists. Knowing is for Jesus. Now, why why were why were you named after the the famous actor Corey Feldman? Oh, I, I do. Your parents have an unusual love for Corey Feldman? No, they just uh, they just decided to name me Corey. Tell me about your mother. Ah, uh, well, uh, she's a, a, a wonderful lady who uh, is church going and... Uh, Ooh, we like that here. And uh, she's married to a, a wonderful man. Uh, Ralph Nader? Uh, no, no. Uh, who's your favorite? Who's my favorite what? Your favorite. Who's mm -hmm. my favorite? Mm -hmm. Who's your favorite? My favorite baseball player. Who's your favorite? Oh, oh. who's your favorite? Uh, you? Damn straight, okay. bitch. Okay. Yep. Follow-up question: Who's your least favorite? I don't know if I have a least favorite. There's... Jesus doesn't like liars. I... There's a gun to your head. Oh. There's a gun to your family's head. There's a gun to the producer David's head. Uh, When's the last time you've been spanked for pleasure? No, oh, I I don't get into that. Have you ever had dirty thoughts about the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man? No, no. You have a very Spanish look about you. 
Uh, you seem like you have a lot of trust issues. I, I, Does that stem I from your parents? Uh, Does that stem from your tickling sisters? I, I think we're making a breakthrough here, folks. I, I didn't realize I was in a therapy. Tell me about your first orgasm. Yo, whoa. Ah, <laughs> uh, no. You're a smart cookie. Uh, how, how's that painting? Oh, it's going great. I mean, we're going to be here for another 18 hours at least. Um, okay. <laughs> Corey, if you could own one franchise restaurant, what would it be? Um, Fuddruckers? Why? Ah, uh, it's a fu fun name. Be because you've eaten so many hamburgers? Uh, yeah, I guess. I mean, it's, uh, it's a fun place to go. I was kidnapped from a Fuddruckers. How dare you say that, sir? How when was the last time you wet the bed? Gosh, I mean, it was, I was young, very young. I have it on good authority that it was about three weeks ago. Is that true? No, I, where did you hear that? Your girlfriend. No, that's not true at all. Hi, Sierra. No, I'm, it was hot that night. I might've sweated a little. You seem to be sweating a little bit now. It, it, well, it's, it's hot in here, Andy. It's not my fault. Do you fear dying? Uh, I think everybody does in some sort of way. I don't. I try not to think about it too much. Are you circumcised? Uh, <laughs> uh, just one of those other questions uh, uh, that I prefer not to answer. It's very important to know where your foreskin is. See, friends, it's just that easy. Asking questions, painting pictures. Are you aroused right now? No, no, no. Hands look a little tight. No, 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 not at all. Could have fooled me. I'll have what he's having. <laughs> Do you think this is going to be a good painting? I heard wonderful things uh, that you you are an amazing painter, and uh, I, I am looking forward to seeing what you've created. Me too. Do you have any other questions that might you know again Corey we can't help you help me with we're having a nice chat here with Corey Stewart if you're just joining us save space for you I'm not crazy yeah smile for me Corey like you mean it can you open your mouth for me wider would you ever have sex with an alien? Andy, that's not, that's not where- What if it was for research purposes? No, that, what type of research would it have me having sex with an alien? Alien sex research? I, yes, but I don't- Follow up question, have you ever murdered before? No, no, no. It's almost like you're not having a good time. I, I never said that. Very good. If you weren't, we'd have to kill you. Your um, segment it is. Oh, um. With a knife. I... I really biffed this painting up, didn't I? Now it's fucked. Y you, can, you can fix it, right? Well, folks, I think we're done with this painting here. Let's take a look, shall we? Yeah. Andy, I gave you $300. You and said you, got... you were going to be able to paint me. Yeah, this is you. You are what you eat. It's no. a... It's, no, it's, it's a commentary on on you owning a Fuddruckers franchise. Andy, you said I'd be riding a horse. Well, it didn't really work. You know, you didn't answer any questions about a horse. I didn't think I was going to be in an interrogation. What is that crap? Well, this David, is David, you told me that this was going to be... I'm, you know is, what? You're, no. wear, you're wearing a burger, you know what? a burger suit. You know what? I can't believe you. I can't believe that. Oh. This has been a... Uh, a portrait of an interview. We'll see you next time, and remember, clean your brushes. That's gonna look great on the wall. <laughs> <laughs>